Well, finally getting these guys hooked up. Finishing this guy up. Got all this. Got a new Perco switch. And then I have, I'll show you later, I have a uh, solar generator that I'll run off of too. So, this battery will go under there. That charge controller will charge it with a solar panel that comes from out there. All this is all hooked up now. Cabin lights, running lights, anchor is actually just the light I have on my wind indicator at the top. Obviously steaming, I have a deck light. Accessory one is my instruments, depth and speed. Accessory two is um, uh, the lights on those instruments. And accessory three, I'm actually going to put some blue LEDs, these guys right here, down there and on, on both sides so that they shoot up this way so at night, um, if you want to see without uh, blinding myself, but yeah, here's the mess. <laughs> Short video today. Oh, what a mess. Oh, look at that. We are charging from that solar panel there. That's plugged into that. And not really a lot of sun, but oh yeah, there we go. There's some sun. Charging. We're on number one. Let's see. Oh! And oh, that's why we weren't the instruments were on. down there and then a blue light right there and right there and the lithium ion will go right there I'll show you a picture of that tomorrow <sighs> all right well I just had you know since I mean it's a short video but I just have one more thing that I wanted to share now that I got everything up in here um, Tiny little things, I gotta do like some hooks for some hats and things like that. And, uh, oh, very important thing, I have to, uh, have to build a bar. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it. Maybe, uh, maybe right there. Yeah, anyway, I gotta find a place to hold some, like, booze bottles and stuff. But, this is my nighttime sailing setup. And, uh, particularly, I'm, I'm probably gonna put one more light in the V-Birth or something. But, you know, sometimes when we're night sailing, somebody has to come down below and you need to look for things and figure things out. So uh, I wanted to make sure that we had non-directional light. So from the cockpit, all this is does is make a nice low glow that I can still see over. And, uh, well, it looks really cool in here. <laughs> and uh, that's right there is, these are just, uh, these are just flush mount lights for cars. And they're blue, so this one lights up underneath where the battery and everything is, and this one just lights the floor, so fire extinguisher, paddle, and then obviously boat hook. So all of that stuff is um, easily accessible. And uh, well, uh, let's see if we can see what it looks like out here. You guys might not be seeing anything but darkness now, but that's okay. I'm gonna see uh, while I'm out sailing. Um, yeah, so while I'm out sailing, somebody can be down there doing stuff, but I can still see everything. It doesn't hurt my night vision at all. Pretty stoked. I'm actually super stoked. <sighs> Amaze balls. Alright, here we go. We're going down coming in so yeah wiring except for maybe like one or two little more of those blue lights uh, probably uh, in the cockpit lockers 
I'll put so if I'm out at night I can see inside the cockpit lockers um, so I'll put one in each one and then maybe one more down here but all non-directional all pointing away from nighttime vision well, I hope you enjoyed all of the uh, Capri 25 wiring stuff and uh, yeah man it's been a long journey and I'm super happy to have it over and uh, I'm not sure if you can see that right there or not but let's see if I can turn this on and light yeah so we're sitting on a really nice easy setup peace <laughs>